Hey makers, this is Rubin, and today I'm just going to talk about that my new training program for Canvas application is starting from the coming Monday, 18th of August. Only two days to go for my new training program. So I received lots of inquiry and lots of FAQs. So let me just uh, share it with all of you guys, so you can also get benefited from that. So many of you have a question that. or uh, who can join this training program what's the level of the training program right so let me tell you uh, there are no such prerequisites to enter into this particular training program if you are having some sort of it background i'm not talking about it background in terms of experience i'm just talking about if you have studied into your graduation even in the it that is also fine so if you are a fresher level or if you are a experienced level or if you are an intermediate level of person or if you are just having one or two years of experience you can enroll into this training program it's really really helpful to everyone now the question is that that okay uh, what kind of prerequisites are required before i go with the canvas application so let me tell you there are no such prerequisites only is that you should have some sort of logical way of thinking logical way of thinking is always uh, anyone who is uh, an it graduate they are having logical way of thinking that how to write a logic so it's a very common fact it's not i'm not expecting too much advanced thing over here and maybe you just required some sort of basic knowledge on uh you know how to uh, what is database what is list what is library uh in terms of sharepoint or uh, you know if you are having the knowledge of sharepoint even if you are not that's totally fine uh at least i'm going to give you high level idea about like what is sharepoint list what is library that high level knowledge is required and maybe it's just like okay what is how to create a table in any technology i'm not just talking even in the excel if you have created table which means that you know what is table like it's a row column combination right so these basic things are required in order to enter into this particular training program now another question come across uh, along with this is what is the level of the overall training program so let me tell you the level of the overall training program is from scratch we are going to start everything we are going to reach to the intermediate level and at the end of the training program you will be having that level of confidence that you will be able to create your entire application by your own so this is completely focused on the business scenario and business use cases it's not like a theoretical classes okay it's like okay from scratch how you can do the complete end to end development for your projects okay this is basically i'm calling is i'm not uh, calling this as a you know regular college classes it's like a professional course it's like a upskilling program right nowadays many people are entering into low code no code space so it is for them like how they can achieve the complex business scenario in a very efficient way in the power apps that's something we are going to learn in throughout the journey okay and the entire training program is 100% project based so literally from uh, from class number 3 to class number 17 we will pick one project definition build entire project end to end along with me covering different aspect and at the end you will do the deployment as well so at the end okay if someone is saying you that okay tomorrow you need to start your powerhouse project you will have that particular confidence in you okay now again another question also people are asking me that drovin what's the course timing what would be the duration so let me tell you this particular course is somewhat which is spanned across uh 3 weeks overall and every day we are uh, going to connect monday to fridays all right uh the reason being is that this is a little bit fast track course over here there is no distraction in between uh, the timing is 4 to 6 30 pm uh, i know many of you will tell me that okay this is sometimes our office hours it is not suitable to me so let me tell you if you are missing any particular class you will always have a access of the recording which is coming across along with the one year of validity so you can always watch the content later on as well depending on your availability okay and again like it's not uh, and it's fully interactive classes guys okay so let's say for an example today you uh, started your day finish your day you did your practice and next day if you are having any question you can ask me over there as well and the last session is also like we are opening completely for q and a and all you can ask any of your question and all so it's like a full end to end learning you'll definitely enjoy it uh, if you are very keen to learn this whole uh, technology stack along with me okay Now coming to the another question, many of you are asking me that Dhruvin, you already have thousand plus videos on your YouTube channel. Then why this training program? What's the difference between your YouTube versus what you are doing in 
uh, in person uh, kind of training program right so let me just tell you about that this this training program is completely online training program so no matter where you are living into uh, if it is a us or uk or any other country or india right so you can join online and you can interact with me and uh, you can learn along with me uh, the thing is that on youtube yes i 100% agree i have everything on my youtube already even i'm not just talking about my youtube channel i'm just talking about the entire globe right nowadays you are having ai tools you are having everything right but still very where, where people are lacking is you know the there is a there is a whole bunch of information right but how many is required because you know our brain consumes the when our brain is consuming lots of information sometimes we are literally getting confused that what is the right way of doing this and all right so i'm i'm not denying that that i i, I have something on my youtube yes i do have uh, because not everyone can afford the training programs right Uh, this training program is something which is helping you and boosting your journey much more faster you know when you are doing the self learning you are watching thousand articles and you know you just conclude couple of things and then then going along with that but here it's a it's a customized path for you it's completely based on the business themes right many of the things i haven't covered on my youtube because youtube is always like a 10 minute or 15 minute video max or maybe one hour video max right so so there is so many things were missing like when you are actually working with the real industry what kind of challenges you face what kind of problems you are facing how to overcome those problem right that's something all we are going to cover up because it's more a real industry kind of project so if you are someone who is actually looking for like a real professional training this is perfect for you that is something is not on my youtube okay but if you just okay i want to learn some concept and all i you know that for that obviously youtube videos are always there you can always watch it and i'm i'm happy to posting in the future as well because because that's something which i love to do it it's not something that you know everyone can uh everyone should need to join the training program but that is the main intention because this is what it is making your journey faster in terms of learning perspective as well as career perspective so that's the reason why we have this particular training program right now the coming to the question like okay what's the fee for the training program so currently at the recording of the video on um 15th august 2025 the fee is 7000 rupees uh, uh we are not offering any kind of demo classes because already you have seen my teaching method on lots of videos so you can explore over there uh, we are having direct enrollment methodology so if you are comfortable to join along with me in the training program you can just uh, call or message us on the numbers mentioned in the description box and uh, you know or you can just connect us and you can just do your enrollment okay and uh, obviously you will enjoy the whole journey for sure 17th episodes are there and overall 40 hours plus content is something we are going to cover up into this whole particular training program okay now the question ar- arises that okay what is the job market am i be re- ready with the job market after this training program okay so let me tell you nowadays job market is very critical in 2025 uh, jobs are there but not like drastically how we are having in 2023 2024 and all right so little bit uh, critical uh, apart from that with respect to because because look it's it's the entire job market it's i'm not just talking about the power platform or power ads job market okay opportunities are still there but nowadays uh, competition is also more uh, because when you are going with the any power platform job with power apps they are also asking for some more skills like power automate power little bit power bi sometimes they are asking for uh, uh, you know power uh, depending on the experience like model driven application power bi so many things they are uh, asking for right so it's depending as a whole package you will get a better offer but at least some some level starting level jobs still available for power apps power automate but again you just need to club two technology at least together like power apps and power automate this is base for the entry level jobs into the world of power platform okay so this is all about it now let's talk about that what i'm going to teach you into throughout this training program because this is as i said like this completely hands on project based real time and interactive training program okay so uh, what you will get at the end of the training program okay let's just talk about that so i'm just going to give you the overall idea that what i'm going to teach you so first of all we will start our journey this entire training program is divided into 17 different session and again the level will be starting from the beginner and at the end we will reach up to the advanced level okay so first we will start our journey with some sort of introduction prerequisites with what is 
power apps, why to use power apps, what's canvas, what's model driven, what's the difference between that, when to choose what kind of approach, all those things will start with. Then we'll go one by one more level up where we will overall take a tour of entire Canvas application studio because to learn any technology, the studio tour is important. So we'll explore each and every uh, functions which are available over there. Uh, also, what kind of controls we are using it. We'll also talk about that. Uh, so at least you will get a complete guided tour of the overall Canvas app, uh, studio over there. Uh, within uh, two big episodes uh, and we'll also start with some base terminology like variables and collection and when to use what things and different kind of licenses which are required for power apps and all so all those things will be covered into class number three and four then we will start from class number five onwards we will actually start the real project so uh, before fourth class uh, we are completely setting up the base that what are the things required to start with the power apps and then we'll do the actual project so literally we will do the requirement gathering uh, we'll see how we can approach out this overall project and we will start building the complete project from the scratch with the data dictionary uh, we'll use the sharepoint we'll use the dataverse we will use the different kind of power automated integration so many things we are going to use it out so we'll start the complete project over here and when we start the complete project with the complete project definition itself we will start learning the different concept like how you can utilize the form inside the power apps and again like a complete complex business scenario that okay not not just building a form but on top of that you have complex rule like okay showing and hiding some element uh, moving some element here and there uh, focus on UI that how best you can design this thing out right how you can apply the custom validation how you can add, do the error handling all those things we are going to cover up with the concept all the things required at the business level all the things we are going to learn from scratch over here after that, we'll start our journey with the, some sort of uh, a complex condition in, that I already uh, talked about. And then we'll overall start with the views and power effects and all. Because again, like uh, when you are having uh, building any particular application at the enterprise level, the volume of the data is very important. So we are also dealing with how you can handle the large data set at your application level. What are the different delegation concept? How you can overcome this situation? People are having different kind of myth that power apps can't be used for the large data and all. all those things we are going to cover up. And again, it's very, very important with respect to interview perspective as well, because in your interview, people are literally focusing on this type of concept when they are uh, uh, when they are hiring any power of developer. So this is like a, a million dollar class where you can uh, learn all those professional expertise with me. Then we'll go with the advanced level classes moving forward, where we'll talk about different kind of patch function, better way of do the error handling, how you can uh, design the complex uh, structures with the power apps with the component library. So we'll talk about that theming, UI, UX, all those things we are going to cover up over here. After that, we'll do the another important thing like security and all, because the real industry project without security, it's not possible. So what are the best practices for security design? What are the things you need to go with? What are the entire checklist you need to follow up for the power of security? Everything we are going to learn A to Z over here into this particular class. And then we will go with the different complex topic that, okay, sometimes you are having complex form with multiple tables, multiple list structure, and sometimes you are having complex structure like repeating section and all. How you can design all those things with the power apps? That is also something we are going to talk about into this class. Then we'll go with the more advanced classes with some sort of integration and custom connector. So again, integration is very key important role like uh, power automate integration or sometimes you need to connect any third party APIs or uh, via custom connector, how you can do that into the power apps. All those things we are going to talk about into that class. Then at the end, when we are done with our project, we'll do the end to end deployment as well. Deployment is very, very important. Most of the people are struggling at that point that what are the best practices for that? How to do the better deployment? What are the checklists we need to follow it? How you can do the rollback or what are the different kind of solutions available? Everything we are going to talk about in detail into class number 15. Then class number 16 is all about AI and power apps. So nowadays we know that AI is entering into any space. So how you can leverage the AI capability for faster project development. We'll also talk about that. We'll talk about the native AI capability, which is already available in the power apps world, like a different kind of plan designer, uh, different kind of prompts, different kind of tips and tricks for power apps. We'll talk about that. And class number 17 is all about your career guidance and any question and answer you are having 
throughout the training program it's not just you can just ask me the question and then in each class if you are having any question you can ask it out because it's a, it, interactive okay it's not just like me teaching it's just like a both way you are also asking the question i'm also answering the question and we are having dedicated slots as well into each session for qla so entire training program is totally interactive okay uh, then also at the end i'll also help you that how you can prepare your resume better how you can uh, write out the different project uh, for yourself uh, what are the way of preparing the certification in the future uh, also we'll also talk about that what are what kind of questions in the interview people can ask everything we are going to cover up into the particular class all right so that's pretty much it about uh, the entire training program if you are keen to learn the complete canvas application with me uh, all the links are available in the description box you can always check it out uh, and uh, you can always connect us whatsapp us or uh, call us on the number below in the description box so see you all on my new training program starting from coming monday on 18th of august till then have a great day goodbye